Greetings and salutations. In this quick video, I want to help you fix your Bluetooth speaker that is no longer charging the battery. So it'll, you see it'll be powered on and it no longer charges the battery. Now I don't care what kind of Bluetooth speaker you have. This particular one is a Sony, but you might have an Anchor, you might have a Bose, you might have an Ultimate Ears. It doesn't matter, GBL, GBL whatever you have, I want to help you fix the issue. All right, at the very end, if you've tried everything, I want you to try the nuclear option, and that's the last case scenario. However, it does seem to work. All right, so the first thing I want you to do is, of course, plug it in, and where, whether you have it on a computer or a desktop, laptop, what I want you to do is try a different USB port on that device. If you've been having it on the side, try it on the back. So basically, try a different USB ports. Sometimes the USB ports do go faulty, Next, if you haven't tried connecting it directly to a wall, get you one of these power adapter, plug it into the wall, leave it for 30 minutes, and then see if that will start charging the battery. A lot of times it will. Try a different USB cord. So the majority of Bluetooth speakers uses the USB-C like this, and I'll put a link in the comment section where you can get one off of Amazon, a new one. Uh, try a different cord. It is possible that your cord is no longer working. Next thing what I want you to do is while you have it powered on, and of course every Bluetooth speaker will be a little bit different, but what I want you to do is I want you to hold down the power button while it's plugged into a power source for a good minute and don't let go. Just completely continue to hold it, all right? And then let go and then see if that will fix it. If you have a Bluetooth light, go ahead and hold the Bluetooth button for a good minute and then let go and see if that will fix the issue. If you know how to factory reset your uh, speaker, go ahead and factory reset it and it will let you. So for example, on the Sony, only thing you have to do is just hold down the Bluetooth button and the minus button while it's on and you hold that down for like five seconds until it powers off and then you let go after about another five seconds. Some of them is the minus and the plus, you hold those down and sometimes that will work, but just look, look on your instructions or Google how to how to uh, factory reset it, and then see if that will work. Um, if you've tried all that, there is something called the nuclear option, which does work. I've done it on a lot of Bose speakers, and what we're going to do is we're going to take it to a freezer. Now this is when you have no warranty left on your speaker. You've had it for a few years. You've tried everything to get it to charge. It won't charge. Um, and what you could do is you can leave it in the speaker. Rather, you can leave it in the freezer on your refrigerator for a good half a day. Let it sit there. And after a half a day, don't matter how many hours, take it out and let it sit for room temperature for a good 30 minutes to an hour and then see if that will start charging the battery. Now, if you have the ability, if it still works while you have it plugged in to a USB cord, USB-C, just go ahead and do that. Keep it plugged in at all times if that will work. Um, but a lot of times that will not work. Uh, but if you don't wanna do that any longer, go ahead and try the freezer method. You'll be shocked that it will work with a lot of your speakers. All right, thanks for watching. Put in the comment section what brand Bluetooth speaker that you have? Do you have a Bose? Do you have a Ultimate Ears? Do you have an Anchor? What do you have? Put that in the comment section and then let me know which method worked.